Hello and welcome to Common Sense TV. I'm your host, the Doctor of Common Sense. Can we stop pretending that there is a such thing as law and order when it comes to those on the left? Can we stop pretending like the Constitution or lying to the FBI means anything? Because Hillary Lawyer, matter of fact, somebody tell John Doom just to shut that whole thing down. Because there's no way in the hell they're going they are going to convict anybody who was colluding to destroy Donald Trump. Now, they came up with a phony Russian collusion, and people who lied to the FBI then were indicted and charged. Michael Sussman, former Hillary lawyer, has been acquitted. Now, the defense argued, the defense for Michael Sussman argued that even if Sussman was found to have given the FBI inaccurate information, that's called a lie, See, that's a fancy way of saying he lied. Inaccurate information about the motivations. They said the lie was uh, immaterial to the investigation that followed. Could those same folks who you were charging uh, when Donald, the phony Russian collusion, when Bob Mueller was charging people? Because there was no Russian collusion. It was immaterial. But they still got charged with a lie. And by the way, even though the Russian collusion was a hoax, Hillary Clinton and the DNC and the FBI all were colluding to destroy Donald Trump. This is a well-known fact. And this fraud was the one of Hillary's lawyers who lied to the FBI, and he's not even charged. Because if you're going to keep putting juries together that love Hillary Clinton, if you're going to keep putting juries together that hate law and order that will never convict anyone who happens to be a left-leaning scumbag, why are we wasting our time with investigation? Sussman gave the FBI data that had been produced by researchers working with the campaign and that purported to link Trump to the Russian via Alpha Bank. That was a lie. Number one, it was a lie. Not only, hey, not only was, was he lying that he was like, uh, some concerned citizens, the information he gave was a lie too. So the accusation was soon found to be groundless, but was part of the overall Russian collusion. How in the hell can you lie about both things? The, the so-called researchers was a lie because it was researchers that Hillary Clinton paid for, and I'm sure this idiot knew about this. Sussman was accused of presenting himself to the FBI as a, just a concerned citizen. First of all, the FBI knew he was lying. They knew he wasn't a concerned citizen. That's the, that's the dirty little secret nobody's talking about. Why is it that the FBI, it keeps getting tricked? You know, the CIA keeps getting tricked. What do we need the FBI for if they let Sussman lie to him? If they couldn't investigate the linked Sussman to Hillary Clinton, why did uh, John Durham even have to possibly... Uh, go investigate this in the first place because the FBI should have charged him. This proves the FBI knew he was lying. This also proves that the FBI knew he was working for Hillary Clinton, but they wanted dirt on Donald Trump because they wanted it to be true. And James Comey went ahead and, 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 and leaked classified information in order to get Special Prosecutor Big Mule Face Bob Mueller to start to waste, what, $40 million on an investigation that they know was a complete hoax. Hillary Clinton and the Clinton Foundation, or Hillary Clinton and the DNC, all conspired, along with the intel community, conspired to destroy Donald Trump. They were unmasking people left and right. This is including Susan Rice and everybody in the DOJ. I mean, what do you need to do to get somebody prosecuted around here? What other law do you have to do? If you got them on video, that don't do you any good. We got them on video with the phony stolen election. John Durham is might as well close down that investigation. See, that's why I didn't get excited about it. I knew he was guilty, just like we know Hillary is guilty of lying. Did they prosecute Hillary Clinton for lying? Because if they prosecuted him for lying, they'd have to prosecute Hillary for lying, and they can't possibly do that. And then we got to go down the line and start talking to you remember that little meeting they had on January the 5th in 2017? Susan Rice, I think it was January the 5th, Susan Rice, uh, bumper car Joe Biden was in there. Uh, I forgot the other woman's name, but I do know uh, uh, James Cummings was there. 
Barack Obama, it was one other person, but I, the name escapes me right now. All these people had a meeting, and that meeting was a fake collusion as if James Cummings was pretending like he was tricked into believing that there was Russian collusion on a fake dossier that any seventh grader could have figured out that the dossier was fake. And when we investigate Christopher Steele, here's a British spy being, meddling in our elections. We had the DOJ, the FBI, all these people. And after they had that meeting, Susan Rice thought something was going to come of it because she didn't mention it. And then the day of the inauguration of Donald Trump in 2017, Susan Rice sends an email to herself. Just wanted to take some minutes. 15 days after the meeting on January the 5th, she sends an email to herself saying that Barack Obama wanted her to investigate it. I mean, how stupid do you have to be, be to believe these people? Of course they're lying. Of course they broke the law. Sussman broke the law. Hillary broke the law. Obama broke the law. Susan Rice broke the law. James Comey broke the law. They all broke the damn law. And Joe Biden knew about it. And then they stole to get him in the freaking White House. You can't even make this up. If somebody wants to do a good TV series, this would be a good TV series with the kind of corruption we have in this freaking country. These are the stuff you can't make up. But they want us to go along with it. I'm not surprised. There is no such thing as law and justice. Please stop quoting the Constitution to me. Please stop quoting any Bill of Rights or anything because it's, 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 it's toilet paper to these people. The laws do not apply to them. It only applies to you and I. Unbelievable.